Okay, are we live? Yes, we should be. No? Are we live? Maybe we're comfortable. Uh, yeah, I think we are live. It just takes a while for people to come in, so we're just going to say to anybody new on here, hello, we're live from a hotel room in Florida. Unknown location because we might get tracked down and killed. Yeah. So horse famous. Okay, I'm teasing, I'm teasing, I'm teasing. Okay. <laughs> hello, LP Florence. Hello, Maisie. Hello, Galaxy Wolf. Hello, Moonlight Magic Jam. Hello, Peyton Hill. Hello, Carrie. Hello, Isabella. Uh, hello, Popcorn Official. Is Banana Princess going to be celestial? Yes, she is celestial. She's the best. Hi, Equestria Toys Movies. Uh, hello, Emery. Hello, Ginger Snap. Hello, Natalie. Hello, Peyton. Hello, Briar Girl. Hello, Shadow the Cat. Hello, everybody. Today, we're going to be showing you the Pony Fair haul that we have. All the things we bought. All the things there. we bought. And telling stories of things as well. Yeah. It's it fascinating like that. Uh, why do you think someone tracked you down? I'm completely joking. I'm yeah. just saying I'm so famous. That's the whole sarcastic joke. Of course, I'm not so famous. Anybody <laughs> would track me down. That's the whole joke. Don't worry, no one's going to track me down. So, who <laughs> wants to see what we got at Pony Fair? Anyone? Anybody Anyone? like to see? We're going to see what's something Madeline's first, or you want to see something yeah. mine first? You guys got to let us know. If you're enjoying time, you're going to say, yes, I am. Thank you very much, Florence. Me, 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 me. Okay. This one. This one. Or this one. Mm, 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 mm. Obviously, it's going to be me. It's my channel. You're right. Everyone loves MLP Fever. She's the famous one, anyways. Look all the hair, though. It wins. I know that long, luxurious mane. It costs a million dollars. I know it does. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. So. No one seems to be answering. Someone says Meep, though. Meep Squad Assemble. Deb. <laughs> That's disgusting. <laughs> Dabbing is disgusting. <laughs> It's too old. MLP Fever, someone says, yeah, it's been decided. I'm going to show first. What do I show first? We're going to show... Mm, I think I will show... It's an LPS set. Something I'm just going LPS to set first at a yes. pony fair? We're going to say the good things. At the, the end, things. okay. Yeah. So we have a Blythe Little Pet Shop's new in box. Isn't that cool? Look, yeah. it's a winter one. It's the middle of summer, but... There you go. I've never been a fan of the Blythe Dolls, but I love her little outfit. Look how cute that is. And the little popper. How could you say no to a little snowflakey boy? The eyes are creepy on the Blythe dolls, though. Like, they follow you. It's like the Mona Lisa. They are scary. They are very scary. Not a fan. The Hello Little Outfit is very adorable. Yeah, oh my god, it's cute. It is very cute. Not seasonal. No. Nope. But it will be at some point. And a great price, too. So. $10 for a Neon Box set, so that was a really, really good deal. I pro I don't really collect Neon Box LPS, so I'll probably be looking to trade it. Open it. No, I'm not going to open it. I'm going to trade it with somebody. Not something as no, it literally doesn't matter. Just show it doesn't matter. Okay, we'll start with a shirt. Because... We're showing clothes. We're showing, We're showing clothes. clothes. Hey guys, new clothing. I got a sea pony t shirt, oh, brand new, brand new five dollar. So I got a new shirt. For... I sponsored it. I said she must have it for pony Much or for brony con. Anyway, that's that. <laughs> Should I show something else because the shirt doesn't really count? Yeah, yeah, you got more stuff than I have yeah. by far. Okay, well, we'll show this girl. So I said one thing I really wanted from Pony Fair is a really nice. Gusty girl, and she is in perfect condition. Let's show your face, love. There we go. I uh, know she is. Beautiful. She's minty mint condition, and she was also a really great price. So this was one thing I said when I was going to Pony Fair. I'm like, I had to look out for her, and I found her, and I love her. So there we go. A new yeah. find, a new friend. Very cute. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What should I show next? We're going to show one of my lovely viewers came up and gave me this little friend. It's a blind bag custom. Look how amazing that is. And then look also this little uh what, what are they called laminated card that's yeah it. in the back is a um is the collectible card. card game isn't that clever yeah so cool and i can't so, remember her username it says it's some kind of username there if you ever see this please leave a comment saying who you are i'd love to be able to thank you in a comment especially oh and look we've got one same. there as well that it's so, so special sweet. i love it so much yeah let us know who you are because i literally couldn't remember if you told me or not. No, I the to... things just happen in such a rush. Yeah. There's several people at once, yeah. so it's really difficult. But really appreciate it. I love it so much. Thank you. Your viewers are so nice making stuff for you. They really are one to create. Yeah. It's like best friend of his best friend. Yeah. So love those. So cute. Okay, you want to share something? Yeah. You got so much more to work with. Yeah, I got a lot of stuff. So um. Being a person, you are. Well, let's take a look at the G2s I got. Yeah. So I got three. G2s. Are we taking out the bags? Or you yeah, we're gonna take them out of the bags. Would we you like to with that yeah. then? So I've got three G2s. Cameras don't like this noise, so we're just going to get this over with. Yep. 
if you want to open this one. The first one is uh, Petal Blossom. This yeah, right I think here. it's Petal Blossom. They have a little Petal Blossom right here. And she is beautiful. I had a Petal Blossom I got at a flea market years ago, but she was in very bait condition. So I really like this one. She has nice, beautiful pink hair and lovely purple lavender body mm -hmm. color. Body Super color. cute. Yep. That you're struggling for words. I, I always struggle. And then words. she's also got Morning Glory hair. I know this because this is one of the ponies I had when I was really little. I don't even know what happened to this one. Anyway, there you go. And she's got, she got this cute little backpack which you can pull out the little ribbon on. <gasps> what? I didn't even know that was a thing. You didn't even know you were buying. No, I did not. Well, the backpack wind... was just a bonus. So. Well, you can wind it back up again, which is super cute. We oh, love. cutie cat. We're not expecting anything from anyone. You don't have to give us anything. Oh, no, Brody you Connor, to, anything. We just love seeing everybody. Yeah, just come up and say of hi. Of course, we appreciate anything given yeah. to us. We don't expect anything at all. So. We just give out stickers to everybody. Yeah. Look at cutie. So. Next one is... Uh, is it Fluttershy? Fluttershy, no. guys. It's Sky Skimmer, but she looks just no, like Fluttershy. No, I call her Fluttershy. She has a butterfly key mark. She has the same colors as Fluttershy. So she is... Lovely buttermilk color. Yeah, so this one's a little bit scuffed up, but hopefully a magic eraser will clean that right off. But she is also very cute. Yep. You want to show your okay, G2s, you guys? show my little... What are they? They're, They're right there. I bought these little baby ponies. I never had these ones when I was little, but I always wanted them. They were... On the back cards of G2 ponies, they show the other ones in that same line. And these ones, I think, are called Jewel and Sparkle. Now, here are the little friendos. I always wanted them, but never got these particular ones. Oh, uh, Crusher Toys Movies so wants pretty. my sticker. You have to bring some to UK Pony Con. Yeah, I probably will. I'll bring a sheet. Yeah. I'll bring a sheet to anybody who wants them. There we go. Those Look. are also really cute little friendos there. Such adorable friendos. Now, the trouble is this particular line, any baby G2 ponies with this color pink hair, and there's really quite a lot, always really fuzzy, but that's just the way it always is. So that was the way it had to be. But look at them. That color's so pretty. Super cute. Uh, should we do the G1s next? You want to show yeah. your G1s? Yeah, I'll show my G1s. So let me, you want to help me? There's a story with those ones. Yeah, there's there. a story for these. So why you take those out of the bag? Okay, yep, that's all the G1s. Sorry, I totally moved the screen. I probably shouldn't have. So, uh, you can move it again. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so I don't know if some people know, there we go, that uh, there's a YouTube channel called Christabella Ponies, and I've actually met them before. And Cleo, we, we, we had just yesterday. Just yesterday, we met them, and they have G1 pony mascots. So I decided when I was there, it's got the whole squad of the family. Squad. So this is Krista. This, this is mom, is dad, and Bella, basically. Bella, and this is Ace. Anyway, so we got the whole fam together. I said that was one thing I really wanted. And so I did. So shout so out to Crystal Bella Ponies. Go subscribe to them. They're they right. call them Bella Pony and Mama Pony, so yeah. that's what they are. They're, they're actually Lickety Split and Baby Lickety Split. But who, and this who's is Wig Wham, them? but... We're not going to call no, them that. So. That's not their names. No, so. it's, also, it's really rare to find these particular ponies with pink hair. It always goes white, because these are extra good condition. Yeah. Wig Wham has a little bit of uh, fuzz, fuzz power. They're all ponies now. Yeah, and this one has some... It looks like some tail rust, but I think it'll be fine. You'll be fine. He's still... They still He's still a nice. handsome boy. Handsome boy. Look at them all. Yeah. Happy friends. All right. Okay, where are we going to move? We're so we're going to move on. Oh, <laughs> there we go. Okay, so those are all the G1s I got. Uh, your turn. My turn. Okay, we're going to show... One couple. question. Were those expensive? The prices were not bad at uh, at Pony Fair, actually. I personally... I, think, I mean, I can't convert it in my head exactly, dollars to pounds, but I still think UK PonyCon was a bit cheap myself so anybody in the uk yeah we're pretty lucky with our pony fair yeah so i mean these were this was also these cheaper. are not bad prices i mean compared to BronyCon, which is the only pony convention i've been to before that in terms of the actual toy stuff that this was a lot better because for some reason they want to like overcharge for every brushable toy at BronyCon. like they're asking 40 dollars for a g1 applejack i'm like it's ridiculous some of the guardians of harmony sets i've seen go for they're trying to sell for 70 dollars i'm like no it's not even worth that these days so it was nice to see someone. Talk about the strange things Applejack. They were everywhere at Pony Fair. Yeah. I think they... everyone bought the, all they saw at Target, probably thinking, oh, this is super rare. They're never going to show up. And then basically everybody had them for sale. Yeah. So, and like just 12 bucks, like nah. retail price. Yeah, basically. retail price. So uh, they're not so rare as people thought. No. Nope. <laughs> they just were coming in slowly, I think. Yeah. So my next purchase was a couple of power ponies. I've these guys like 
two dollars fifty each. Yeah, yeah, you were. They were very. We had to we had to like go around and check all the the stalls. There was bins see. on the floor. You see for the cheaper ponies. Yeah. You have to really dig through to get them. But I found these pretty girls. No. I'm just going to give them hair. That's my actual. Yeah, hair. he had actual hair there. <laughs> we have a hairbrush, and they should look really pretty. You see, I have Flash and Twilight at home, and the Maniac, and I wanted to finish the set, so I got these two cuties. Yeah. This Pinkie Pie is actually a white body, and then they painted pink on her face. So that's a little unusual. Yeah. So there you go. There you go. All right, so who's next? Uh, I guess I'll go with the miscellaneous. I Why are you live at 11 p.m.? Because we're in Florida, and right now it's only 20 past six. Yeah, Sorry. So, yeah. Hope you find the yellow G2 pony, pony gone. You definitely will, Wonder Crates. That's one of the most common G2s there is. And she was super cute, too. She was everywhere, yeah. even over here, yeah. so you'll definitely find her. So in terms of some miscellaneous, I got... Um, some Kitty Mark crew, some completers I needed, needed a uh, vinyl scratch. I needed this 2011 McDonald's um, Twilight. So one dollar. One dollar. And these Kitty Mark crew, they were like three for five. I they, I couldn't even find another one. So each one was like two bucks. Also a really good deal. And then I also got a uh, Equestria Girl Fluttershy that I needed from the Series 2 one. So... That is a pretty good deal in my book. Um, your turn. Okay, I'll show. We found some LPS, and I'll show you the ones we got from my friend. Oh, our friend. Our friend. Our yes. friend Michelle Wick of LPS. But these are the ones that we got. Madeline wanted a little yellow ferret. I needed this guy from a ferret collection. Then we found an extra one of Madeline's mascot. My bird. I thought, well, you know, we got to get it. I don't know why we just had to anyway, yeah. but there you go. And they were also really the LPS were really reasonably priced. It was priced. three five dollars, and that's a pretty good deal. Ferrets are really popular. So. And then I'll just quickly show the ones we got from Michelle. Why you grab those? Oh no, too um, late. I got it. Oh, I'm just gonna bring in some stuff over we've here. Got a, hey, you're knocking the computer oh, around, God, woman. I'm sorry. We've got a spider, a raccoon. Two burbs. Two burbs. And we have this little mouse and a chinchilla. So those are really good. Yeah. We sent Michelle a video saying, oh, here's all of them. Which ones do you want? This one, this one, this one, this one, this one. So that's that. That's that. Okay. Next, uh, G3. We have mistletoe because I always said that G4 ponies needed Christmas ponies. Of course, they never really made them ex except for Minty. So... And she was really cute, so, you know, around Christmas time. Mistletoe but. loves to rush into winter fun. She was a little too, too quick, though. When she got the skating pond, uh, when she got to the skating pond, on the discovered she brought three skates instead of four. Oh, you see how sweet is that? See, but they were cute. They were. They don't like the faces as much as G4. I don't know, I just... Yeah. I was never sold on G3s the same way, but this is a cute one. Yeah, agreed. Okay. G3s are so cheap as well. I mean, if you want to be a yeah. G3 collector, you'll be the richest out of anybody like yeah. if you're a g1 collector any other generation you're not going to have as much money as g3 collector yeah, definitely so okay, well, who's next your turn a bag of blind bag ponies this is only five dollars so i thought it seemed like a pretty good deal i'll just fish out a couple of my favorite ones mm -hmm. but i especially noticed hang on a sec where's octavia there's an octavia in there i need another there's octavia in there yeah, so oh, yeah, I yeah. noticed there was a DJ and an Octavia, so I thought they were little buds that we keep together. I forget this guy's name, but I'd like him. Oh, uh, yeah, the... Um, I can't remember. Yeah, I forget his name, too, from that one this, episode. This little sandcastle pony. I just that's like, not a sandcastle, that's a rook. Looks like it's made of sand, though. It's totally a rook. Well, I thought it might be a chess piece, but look, it's all kind of rough like it does. We get folks up close. Look, you see that it looks kind of like it's made of sand. Okay, sure. It's not much well rock. Anyway, the one, most noticeable one was the Sakura. Look yeah, that one's really cute, but with the gold instead of the just painted the yellow. It's painted yeah, with the gold. Much more. Trouble shoe. There we go. Atomic glitter coming in clutch. Thank you. Thank you. Thank so, you. There's always someone in the stream yeah. who remembers more than I do. Is G4 Minty expensive? Uh, you can find. Yes and no. No. Yes and no. You can find her on AliExpress for like really cheap. You're gonna have to wait like two months to get it. But I've seen it on AliExpress. Yeah, you, you can it. get it for a good price. Yeah. Next one. Next one, we got. Well, you did. What? Well, you got it. Well, yeah. Uh, Rainbow Dash camping trip set for fifteen bucks. But I noticed something really strange about this set. There's a hole here, as though you should feel something, and it's really just a bit of plastic. I don't know what that hole is all about. So, I'm so confused by that. I don't get that either. Um, but yeah, the box is a little beaten up, but I'm just gonna unbox it anyway. So. Would you ever make your mascots as the old yeah. generation's pony? What you mean, like customs? That would be really cute. Yeah, just having your mascot in every generation. That would be cute. That'd She's be struggling cute. with just the one she already has. It's got chips on it. Yeah. <laughs> so. Yeah. We'd we'd have to see how that happened. 
<laughs> yeah. If anybody would ever do it. So, your turn. Okay, what should I show now? You got the other two power poles, please. I found these guys in the unbox, and they were really not expensive. Well, they were. Like, Those were. They were cheaper than some of the out of box ones. Yeah, yeah they were five dollars each or something. Even less than that, I think. Yeah, they were very, very cheap, so mm -hmm. I thought I'd get those. That finishes my power pony set, so I was pretty happy about yeah. that. It's just too bad that they don't have like, the green wrap around her hair. Yeah, it's you just that. It has that it with the yourself. fashion style ones, but not yeah. with the... They didn't bother with these girls. Yeah. Uh, well, I should probably unbox these, shouldn't I, for um, travels? Yeah, we'll unbox them later. Or you can unbox them well, it's whatever you want. Yeah, let's take a look at them. There's yeah, one sure. coming up, actually, the back of the card yeah. And I'll answer some questions while we're here. Uh... What do you like about each other? Everything. <laughs> Nothing really. <laughs> Nothing. Wow. Um, how sad Just are you? Just the pony shopping. That they don't make G4 ponies anymore. I mean, they take G4.5, and I'm fine with those. I'm not. But she's not. I, it doesn't really bother me that much. It doesn't bother me that much. She still buys all, even though she doesn't yeah. like them that much. I'm going to Brony Con. I can't <laughs> wait to meet <laughs> you. You know, I'm trying to read comments here. You're being so insulting. <laughs> Anyways, JJ Dash going to BronyCon and having a birthday party on Saturday. Oh, that's so sweet. Oh, that's so great. Yeah, we'd love to meet we'd you. We'd love to see you. Yeah. Wish you happy birthday. Yeah. That's a great way to spend a birthday. Yeah, for sure. Cleo, what's your favorite color? I'm going to go with pink. I like pink. Yeah, that's yeah. my favorite color. Sure. <laughs> Would you ever make your mascots as G1, G2, MLPs? I would love to. So we just but said, yeah. I, I could not personally. I would have to commission it. Yeah, we'd have to get some other people doing it. It costs a lot of money because G2 bases are expensive. Yeah, that's true. So we got our girls out. Also, you'd really struggle because yours is a unicorn. They'd have to sculpt on a horn. Oh, yeah. You're right. The unicorns are so expensive. No one would make a base. Yeah. Mm. See, I feel like you're. Where, where's my. See, I feel like you're, you're pretty close. Maybe a little lighter pink. There are other pink ponies, yeah. and they're all Earth ponies of G2, so it mm -hmm. wouldn't be difficult. There we go. There's the girls that are gelled fringe. Look at that. Yeah, you can degel it if you really wanted, but. Mm, I don't know. I quite like the, the style one, you know. Ooh, it's Jojo Siwa is going to meet us at BronyCon 2. Yay! What? It, well, her name is. Oh, it's Jojo. It's Jojo. No, the real. The real Jojo Siwa. The real Jojo Siwa is coming to BronyCon, not a clickbait. <laughs> Um, I don't think she. I don't um, think she was. Yeah, I think I've heard about that through the grapevine. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Can you show some stuff next. Yeah. Okay, guys. We got fashion style Daisy Dreams. This was one of my more expensive purchases, but I really wanted her. Mm -hmm. So it's she just is. too bad you didn't buy the one I have for sale. I that was some okay. um, years ago. I found these in a toy shop. I accessed them and I was selling them on. She saw the listing and didn't buy it. I didn't buy it. I was this close and I was I just didn't Oh, feel it's like too it. expensive, she thought. Then she goes on to buy this for more money than I was charging. What what you gonna do? Mm-hmm. If she would have just kept one for me, knowing that we'd be friends years later, I would have no, I, I should just be it. psychic. <laughs> so I'm probably gonna unbox her later because her box is also mushed up. Dented in. Yeah. So we'll take They're out. not much fun in the box. No, they're not. And this one's a it's really beat up box. So I'll unbox this later, but... What about this girl, it. though? Oh, man, this girl... We're getting to the fun stuff here. This girl is, like, Day of the Dead Celestia. This no, she's not. She's Chinese-style. Look. Chinese-style? I don't know. She got this... Either That's way. Not Day of the Dead. They have black outlines. They, have, they made a Day of the Dead kind of theme. That was the Pony Mania theme. Yeah, you're right. Anyways. Anyways. Technically, this is Rainbow Power themed. Technically, yeah, it, look, it looks to me like it's kind of more of a Chinese esque look. Anyways, that's beside the point. What Which is very far from Mexico. <laughs> it's like on the opposite side of the planet. You know what? Well, this is just, we're all a melting pot here in America. So it's. But it was made, it was literally made in China. You know what? Anyway. It's literally made in China. Okay. Can I, can I keep going? Canadian show. Can I keep going, please? Okay. To describe this beautiful. That everyone can already see, so why are you describing it? <laughs> what they can't see though is this is a factory sample because look it still has this factory wing piece right there so that's really cool this pony no, was also not. that's just ruining the aesthetic of the pony this pony was really hard to find too I could never find the actual set that she came in she also came with the twilight so the fact I have her and she's the factory version that is pretty cool so Anyways, anything else? Just because something's rarer doesn't mean it's better. Well, that doesn't really add anything. 
You know, my brother Forbes always says his toenail clippings are one of a kind, super rare, but nobody wants them. Well, I want this one. Toenail, he wants toenail clippings? I'll take those too. I, mean, I wouldn't be surprised. If he painted ponies on his toenails, you would probably buy them. If you grow them out and he clipped them off, like pictures of pony on toenails, yeah, you'd probably yeah, buy just, them. Well, just, just, uh, <laughs> God, <please> stop it. <laughs> There's some uh, pony stickers on toenails and you'll buy them. I know. I was thinking more like pony art with toenails, like mosaic tile. <laughs> oh, there you go. You guys paint them before me. God, you're even more degenerate than I am. <laughs> you just thought of that. Anyway. What can I say? You just thought of that. And anyway, I'm basically out of stuff, so we're going to have to show more of yours. Okay, well, that's easy. Um, so, yeah. We're showing that. that girl. We're showing this girl. This is also a great story. Look, oh, wait, wait, wait. No, let me guess. Is there anything wrong with this Rainbow Dash? You guys tell me. You see if you watch can my you videos. See, can you see if there's anything wrong with this Rainbow Dash? Let us know. We're going to wait for the comments. Yes. Yes, there's loads of Afterjacks that uh, PonyCon wanted to create, so don't worry about it. You'll find any common ponies there. Does anyone who watched my recent video know who this girl is? Well, anyone at all. Doesn't even have to be anybody who watched the video. Yeah, well, no I, wings. She has no wings. She has no wings. She discorded, yeah. yes. She has no horn. She has no horn. So, yeah, I well, the only reason I mentioned my videos, that was the last video I uploaded, about all the prototypes and factory test samples I happen to own. And I had this girly already, and I never thought I would get another one. Yes, it is walking pose. You got that right, cutie cat. So, this girl, I'm thinking, I saw her on the table. I'm like, hey, no price, no price on her. I, I'll, I'll admit I paid about, I think, 35, 40 bucks for mine, the one I have. I go up, and I'm like, how much is this rainbow dash? The lady goes, seven. I'm like, 70? So, I got a factory test rainbow dash for $7. That is the steal of the century right yeah, there. I was saying, the funniest thing is, obviously, she didn't realize it was anything special to collectors. So I was thinking, actually, if she thought that was just a regular Rainbow Dash, she was charging over the odds. Yeah, so it was, yeah, she, she even said that, like, she, like, oh, I don't collect G4. She's like, whose pony, what pony is this? I'm like, oh, Rainbow Dash. Oh, yeah, I know yeah. it's Rainbow Dash, yeah. she says. Yeah. Anyway, so there you go, she didn't know about awesome. G4, so, that's the story. Yeah. So more that's your awesome. stuff to show. Are we going to yeah. show the PS2 well, stories got, yet? Oh. Not yet. We got one more. Hey, oh, be careful. Oh. You all right there? We good. Chicken pie. We're going to open up chicken pie. Let's open up. So. This was the Pony It was pony Fair in San Diego Comic Con, wasn't it? Yeah, in so 2015. Have, yeah, I can't so. believe it. It feels like just yesterday everyone was saying how lame is it that they're just doing Pinkie Pie for the special. Yeah. Yeah, Atomic Glitter got the deal of the century. I got really, that was, I was not, I was, like I said, I was, when she said seven, like I couldn't hear her. I was like $70. What? Let's see this girl. Right, I've never see seen her in person. Ah! Bacock! Oh my goodness, it's very flimsy. It is. In a popcorn bucket. No, it's a, it's a KFC bucket. Is it a popcorn chicken bucket, you know? It's popcorn chicken, yeah, there we go. There's the girl. There she is. She's cute, though. I feel that fluff. It's soft. It's soft. I know, it's really fluffy. So oh, and she's got derp, guys. Look. Look at those derp pies. Oh. Like that. There we go. So, she is super cute. And um, she was also a pretty good deal for. Don't uh, say how much it yeah. cost. No, I'm not. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, and I thought that she would look good next to um, the Twilight, the Star Swirl one. So. She cute. Yeah, she cutie pie. Everyone, was, I remember when this was new, everyone was talking for about how disappointed they were that a special exclusive pony is just a Pinkie Pie in a dress up. It's, it's and it so was cute, disappointing. Though. Yeah. There you go. That's there. Halloween Pinkie Pie. Yeah. So she cute. So I show uh, the Dustin first then? Yeah, I'll what, show your the thumbnail pic yeah. last. Where is she? Look at this beautiful little custom I bought. Are you seeing this? All this fluff. Look how detailed the eyes are. all done by hand. And you know, does anybody recognize this mold? I think not because... This is a custom mold. It's not just a custom. It is an original sculpt. Isn't that crazy? There was only three little baby pennies when we got there for sale like this, and I thought, I have to have some. It's, what was the name of the customizer? Oh, the, shoot. I um, can't remember. There were so many stalls. It's yeah, just hard to take remember. it all in. Anyway, look. She's look at this beauty. Though. Look, look all that hair. It's a lot of hair. She's so cute. I love her I so much. I haven't even touched her yet. No, don't don't ruin her cards. I love the pink and the white. There were two other ones in different colors. I was going to have a more fall colors, and there was a blue and peach hair. But this this was the one. Yeah. Look. Look at her. Yeah. She's all full of glitter and sparkle as well. Yeah. 
So I could have had that for the same price, or I could have had a G2 play set, but I thought this would go in my G4 ponies and it takes up a lot less space. So I was very happy with that little purchase right there. So yeah. That customer is on Instagram. I follow her. To him, actually, it was the guy. It was yeah. a guy there? Yeah, so. it was a guy. I forget his name. I, I wish <sighs> anyway. we, we didn't grab his card. So I did. It's somewhere, somewhere around. Uh, uh, Clay, did you know more subscribers? More subscribers than somebody, or I've gained more. Probably gained more. Gained more. Yeah. Well, that's great. I'm glad of that. I'm getting really close to sixty thousand now. Yeah. It took a long time to get there from fifty k. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna show the piece of resistance. Okay, look, here we found a super weird thing, one of those bins on the floor. It was the first out. thing we found, actually, so. Banana girl, giant size. Look how big these are. They're as big as my face. Look at that. What are Think these? Think about the usual size. I mean, basically, a Celestia is basically that kind of size, isn't she? Yeah. Look. What's up with these? They're, They're so insane. big. I didn't even know these things existed. So as soon as we saw them, I'm like, but. Why? But why? I have to have them. So, they were five dollars each. Also, a pretty good deal. They're really, so. really heavy. Yeah, they feel they're rather solid. The plastic, so they're, they're quite heavy. Uh, oh, thank you turn. so much. Eyes are Alyssa sticky for some reason. And thank you, Elizabeth. You guys are so sweet. How was Disney World though? Uh, I need to know to the Manhattan. I didn't see that character. No, I saw about a lot of different yeah. characters around. We actually did a meet and greet with Anna and Elsa. And with Kylo Ren. And with Kylo Ren. That was so funny. So, I think they might be on steroids. Uh, probably. Don't do drugs. Don't ponies. do drugs. This is what happens if you do drugs. You can, you get bulked up. They're just ridiculous. Yeah, they're so big. I don't understand. Well, also, amazing. They're very, very accurate. I know. They... Ones. And who made them? Why have they been made? Why have I never seen them before? I know. That's why I was... When did these happen? Are they fake? We're pretty... Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're fake. Like, uh, yeah, these are definitely Hasbro fake. Hasbro never produced no. these. So, But they but seem legit. Understand. Like, the way that the plastic... The plastic feels like... It feels the same. It feels the same. The, I know so. Hasbro didn't make any like this. Yeah. So that's just strange. Did you see Jar Jar things? No. But yeah. I did see him on the greatest ride at Walt Disney World. Star Tours! Why though? Star Tours is the best ride at Walt Disney World. Tell me all we about it. We rode it six times in one day. It's fantastic because there's 50, 54 possible scenarios on this simulator ride. And the ride based on going like basically a the Star Tours bus through space, taking you on a journey for like 1401 with C3 beyond the pilot. And it's an animatronic in front of you. And then there's the screen with the simulator ride. And it feels like you're flying through the Star Wars world. Did you see Winnie the Pooh? We went on the ride, and I did see him from a distance, he and uh, Tigger. Yeah. How is life in the UK? I'm asking because I'm uh, in America. I love your accent. Thank you very much. Life in the UK currently apparently very wet and cold, so I'm quite glad to be in Florida right now. Star Tours fever. Droid MLP coming in clutch. Star Tours. Star Tours. Star Tours. I love Star Tours. It's the best ride. Everyone says it's Flight of Passage, but that's not my favorite simulator ride. My favorite is Star, Star Tours. Tours. Uh, you know what? I wasn't the only one who thought that. Behind me as we got off Star Tours, there was somebody saying in the background, I heard, said to his kids, hey, I don't understand. That was just as good as the Avatar one. Did he and go it is. on Tower of Terror? She did. She I did, did not like it. I didn't it. really like it. Like, it didn't make me feel sick or anything. I wasn't scared. There was this really annoying French-Canadian family talking and yelling oh, the whole gosh. time. Yeah. And not just screaming out of fear kind of thing, just chatting and being annoying. So they kind of ruined the atmosphere, and then I didn't enjoy the motion. It doesn't. It's not just a drop ride. I imagined it would go ding, 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 like an elevator, and then whoosh down. It actually shakes you up and down like a ragdoll, and I didn't really like that. For the record, I love Tower Terror. It's a great ride. What's your favorite animal? I love all animals. They, they're all so necessary for this planet. You can't choose a favorite. I'm not saying this to brag. I actually got stars while I got to my tenth birthday last year. Oh, congratulations, oh, Alyssa. Awesome. She's such a pretty pony. She is. Uh, are you both going to see the new Lion King? No. no. Sorry, we're not into the live action idea. Nope. Zero out of ten. We like the little we cartoon We saw friends. the Lion King, Festival of the Lion King at Animal Kingdom. Oh, I love the Festival of the Lion King. And it was so much better than the movie. And I'm saying that having not seen the movie. Oh, you got, you've got a question for you. I got a question for me? Madeline. My favorite holiday. Um, asks Emily Sandberg. Favorite holiday? Mm, like Christmas. Christmas is yeah. everyone's favorite, I think. 
Um, let's go back a bit. Let's see what else. Is. Uh, Oh, are you, I'm sad that my play G4 is ending. I think it's kind of about time, though. I know a lot of yeah. everybody says, oh, no, it's so sad. But I think I'm really looking forward to G5. I did a video about it when they first said it was ending. Yeah. I did say I, I think I'm happy for a new beginning for ponies. Because as you can see from our haul today, we like old ponies, too. Where, so where all ponies... Wait, where's, all, our, where's oh. our G, G3... There she All is. ponies are created. E no, this was awful. No, um, that's a fake pony. That's, that's a fake one. Species. This is the. There we go. All ponies are created equal here. Where it's it a terrible angle you've got right there, but you get the picture right. There we go. There we go. <laughs> but there's four generations of cuteness. So if we like all past ponies, of course we're going to like future ponies. Yeah. Even if you don't like every single one, even G3, I'm not a big fan of. But you can find a cute one. You can one find some so goodness yeah. in any pony generation. Yeah, exactly. Nobody hates one generation unless you're an angry brony. Yeah. <laughs> or an angry G1 fan. That's true. I, I, I always say that the G1 fans of My Little Pony are just like the G2 LPS fans who only like the old ones. I will only like my childhood ones. And I think, yeah, but things have to change. They can't keep selling the same toy forever. That would be really yeah. boring. No, we don't like G3.5. We just don't talk about those. They don't exist. They don't exist. What's G3.5? Yeah. What are you talking about? I'm uh, not talking about That's that. just... No, I've never heard of that before. That was such a mistake that only lasted for like a year before they realized Okay, that was a mistake. I think we might wrap this up and we've shown everything off. We, we did. About it. And so. if you were at Pony Fair today, thank you so much for coming up. Yeah. It was so lovely to meet everyone today. It, it really made it extra special. Mm -hmm. Agreed. It was a lot of fun. So I hope you all enjoy the rest of your evening. I'm sorry if you had to watch this later, if you wanted to watch it, because we didn't really stream at a very European-friendly time. Yeah, sorry, but we, it, we've been on the road. We've so. been on the road! On the country roads! <laughs> My copyright strike. Yeah. <laughs> can't wait to see UK PonyCon. I can't wait for UK PonyCon. It's such a great convention. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I will say goodbye to everybody. So I'll start saying the goodbyes. Goodbye, Emily. Goodbye, Lily Blossom. Goodbye, LPS Day. I was going to say goodbye. Is anybody else going to say goodbye? Yeah. <laughs> well, um, goodbye, MLP Pig. Goodbye, my name is Derpy. Goodbye, MLP Cupcake. Goodbye, Wonder Creates. Goodbye, Skywish Tube. Goodbye, Emerald Joy. Goodbye, Pony of Chaos. Goodbye, JJ Dash. Oh, oh, we'll see you at BronyCon, of course. I'm very yes. excited for it, too. Goodbye, Vam. Oh, we'll see you at BronyCon, too. Oh, Woo! Yeah, a lot of people come to BronyCon. Goodbye, Melody Panic. And goodbye to everyone else watching. Thank you Bye. so much for watching. Yes, we're sure we want to end the stream. Thank you. <laughs>